The messenger RNA that encodes the major vault protein, MVP, is depicted by this thin orange line. Ribosomes are the cellular machines that translate the message into protein. The large and small ribosomal subunits, colored blue and yellow, attach to the mRNA and move along and produce the growing MVP chain, illustrated in red, emerging from the ribosome exit channel. Successive ribosomes attach and proceed along the mRNA. This arrangement of multiple ribosomes decorating an mRNA chain is called a polyribosome. Within a few seconds after protein synthesis begins, we can see the newly formed MVP chain emerge from the first ribosome. When about half of the MVP chain is produced, it's long enough to make contact with the growing MVP chain emerging from the ribosome moving along just behind it, forming a dimer. Behind the first dimer, there's another dimer that is formed, and beyond that dimer, yet another dimer forms. If you focus your attention on the right side of the polyribosome, you can see what happens as the first MVP chain is completed and the first ribosome falls off the mRNA. The MVP dimer stays tethered to the polyribosome as the ribosomes leave. The first MVP dimer forms side-side contacts with the second dimer that's coming up behind. What is seen is a growing sheet of MVP dimers that remain attached to the polyribosome as more and more dimers join. The MVP dimers curve up away from the polyribosome and begin to form the body of the vault particle. The final vault structure is realized when 39 MVP dimers come together and the finished vault pinches off from the polyribosome and the final folding process of the vault continues to completion.